Okay, so this week in social studies, we're going to be learning all about artifacts. So when you look at this word artifacts, you could you might notice that the first three letters A R T spell art. Art is something that's made by people, and guess what? Artifacts are things that are made by people too. So right here, there are three artifacts that are from the past that teach us about what people lived like at that time. This one is actually a telephone. Over here we have a television, and here we have a bicycle. So we have all of those things today, but they look different. Things change over time. So once again, what is an artifact? Artifacts are objects made by people and teach us what life was like at that time. So the time when they were made. So everything on this page was actually made in the past. This first one right here says that it is a pocket watch. Obviously, this was made to tell people what time it is. Underneath there is something called a record player. Now, you might see record players still today, but at the time when record players were created, um, that using that record and that record player was the only way that you could record something that you could listen to later. So it might be someone singing. It might be a speech. Anything that you wanted to record and be able to listen to again had to be done on a record player. Telephones. We know what telephones are today, but they look super different from what they were like in the past. Here we have the horse and buggy. This was um, how people were able to get from place to place. You can see that the horse is pulling this, what was called a buggy, and that there's a person who's sitting in there. So instead of cars, that's what they used at that time. Now here we have the feather pen and ink. And you might remember from Mrs. Connolly's story about her dad in school that he used actually um, ink like this to write. This is a lantern, which again, we have these still today, but back in the day when they were created, it was the only way for the, them to have light when it was dark. And this was something really special at the time it was created. This is a wood burning stove. They literally burned wood inside of here and on the top they could use that as a cooking surface. In addition to that it heated houses. So today we don't use our stoves to heat our houses. We have heaters and we our stoves look really different and we don't have to put wood inside of them to burn um, to cook. So here's what those artifacts look like today. These are things that you probably see all over the place. Over here we have a regular stove. No longer do we have to put wood inside of it to get it to work. This is a diff really, really different telephone. This is actually an iPhone, which is a cell phone, and um, that's something very new that exists now that you can walk around and talk on the phone. It used to be that you had to actually be in the place where the phone was. And then this is the iPhone watch, which or the iWatch, which obviously is very different from the pocket watch that you saw on the other page. These are light bulbs. Instead of using lanterns today, we just have light bulbs and we use electricity to be able to, um, to see in the dark. This is AirPods, so when we're listening to things, we can have it hooked right up to our ears. This is a car, so instead of taking a horse and buggy, now we use cars. And instead of having to have ink and a feather pen to uh, write with, we now use pens and pencils. So here's your first task for this week. What you have in your packet is you have all of these pictures, these artifacts from the past and artifacts from today. What you're going to do is cut them out and then on the other page you're going to sort them. You're going to figure out is this a picture of something that we use today or is this a picture of something that was used in the past? So you're going to decide, does it go on the side that teaches us about the past or is it teaching us about life today, the way people dress today, the kinds of um, technology we have today? So that's your first task. And that's all that you have to do for the first day of social studies this week. I'm going to show you the second task also, but you don't have to do that today. You could do that another day if you want. The second task is to look at the different artifacts that you sorted and then write about one way that life has changed over time based on the pictures of those artifacts.
So as you can see in the sample, it, this is showing the pocket watch and the eye watch. What is different about those two and how does it show how life has changed? Long ago, people used to keep a pocket watch in their jackets or pants pocket. Now people wear watches on their wrists. The eye watch tells time, sends messages, plays music, and takes phone calls. So look at how that's showing how much a watch has changed over time. In the past, all it did was tell people what time it was. Now you can have something on your wrist that actually tells you the time. You can send messages to people. You can play music from it. You can make phone calls on it. That's pretty amazing how much that has changed. Okay, so it's time for you to start investigating those artifacts for, tax, for task one. I hope that you enjoy learning about artifacts this week.